Hey, Tony here. Today I'm going to show you all of my TV shows on Blu-ray, so stay tuned. So I recently had a request to show all of my TV shows in my collection, and I recently just did a video of all of my um, TV shows on DVD. So today I'm going to take the time to show you all of my um, TV shows on Blu-ray. I'm going to do all of these in alphabetical order. Um, I'm also going to include any kind of TV miniseries that came on, and it will also include any kind of streaming service like Netflix or Hulu. Okay, first up, we have the miniseries AD, The Bible Continues. This is a continuation of the Bible miniseries. We have American Crime Story, The People vs. O.J. Simpson. I really enjoyed this um, series. Um, very good Blu-ray release. American Gods. Um, this is a complete first season. Never actually seen this one, but I heard a lot of good things about it. Okay, I have that American Horror Story. This was the first season. Um, really enjoyed the first season. I actually watched all of the other seasons after that and purchased them, but I have recently just sold all those. Um, I'm not really interested in re-watching any of these. And also I have American Horror Story Coven, which I haven't been able to sell yet, but hopefully somebody will be interested in buying that. Then I got the uh, Metal Tin of Band of Brothers. I've heard a lot of good things about this. I've actually had this in my collection for quite some time. Just have never had the time to watch it. Another series that I really enjoyed was Bates Motel. Um, I actually watched every episode of this series. Really enjoyed it. I've only purchased season one. I'm really waiting to get a better price on the complete series before I purchase any more. Okay, another great series is Batman, the 1966 TV series. Um, I actually used to own a big box set of this, and um, recently, in the past couple of years, I downsized to just this little box set, which I've never opened or watched. And with that, I've included Batman the movie because it's based on the same TV series. And I've also got it in a still book from the UK. I really like this still book. Okay, next up is the miniseries The Bible. Um, this right here was a great miniseries. I was able to catch a few episodes of this. Um, so I bought that one on Blu-ray. Another good series that I really enjoy is Better Call Saul. So I have Better Call Saul Season 1. And I've also got the Steelbook Edition from the UK of Season 1. And I've got Better Call Saul Season 2. Now, I haven't been able to pick up the other releases. I think they may have Season 3 and possibly Season 4 out on Blu-ray, but I've only got it up to Season 2. Okay, another great series is The Blacklist. Um, I've got Season 1, and I try to pick up all of the exclusive. So this is the Target exclusive. Season 2 with Target exclusive. And Season 3 with the Target exclusive. I haven't picked up any other seasons yet. And then I've got Black Cell, Season 1, Season 2, and Season 3. I've also got the series Blind Spot, Season 1. This is the Target exclusive. Now, I've watched Season 1, but haven't caught any of the other seasons after that. So I haven't purchased those yet. Okay, another series that I have never seen is Arrow. Um, I do watch some of the other series, like um, I watched The Flash, and I watched DC's Legends of Tomorrow, but I've never really caught Arrow, um, except for the crossover episodes, but I've got Season 1, Season 2, Season 3, and Season 4, and then I've got Season 4 with a still book from Best Buy. I've got Ash vs. the Evil Dead Season 1. Still need to get the complete series on that. I also recently picked up Batman the Animated Series. This is the Collector's Edition with the um, little Funko Pop minis in it. Pocket Pops. Another great series I have is Breaking Bad. I actually watched all of these before, back when they were airing. Really enjoyed this series, so I had to get this nice box set. And I also picked up the UK box set that has all of the different artwork with all the different characters on them. So um, Breaking Bad is one of my favorite series of all time. Okay, I've got Community. Now I recently did an unboxing video of this, so I'm going to put the link up above if you'd like to check that out. Never actually seen that series. 
um, Da Vinci's Da Vinci's Demon season one and season two. DC's Legends of Tomorrow season one. I've seen every episode of all all of the seasons that have been released. Just haven't purchased them yet on on Blu-ray. Another great series is Dollhouse season one and season two. I really enjoy Dollhouse. Very good series. Okay. Um, Dr. Seuss's How the Grinch Stole Christmas. It was released on TV, so I'm including this in my collection. Another great series is Fargo. So I really enjoyed season one, and we watched, we've seen all the seasons, but season one was probably my favorite. Unfortunately, they haven't released all the other seasons on Blu ray. I think we might have season two on Blu ray, but I don't have that one in my collection. But Fargo, season one. Okay, Fear the Walking Dead, season one. Another release of season one with special features. Um, season two and season three. We really enjoy um, Fear of the Walking Dead. Okay, another great series is Firefly. Okay, we have Flash um, season one and season two. And then we have a still book for season two and a still book for season three. Freaks and Geeks, another great series. Um, got a very nice box set for that. Frozen Planet. Okay, here's a series that I have not seen. I've seen the first few episodes, uh, but I haven't watched all of them. But I have season one, Game of Thrones. Season 2, Season 3, Season 4, Season 5, Season 6, and Season 7. There were two releases for Season 7, um, and that's both of them uh, with the different stones in the middle. <clears throat> okay, we have Generation Kill. Gotham season one. I really enjoy Gotham. Um, seen every episode of Gotham. I've got season one in my collection, and I also have um, the season one ten. Now the season one ten actually has just season one inside of it, and I also have Gotham season two. But I have not purchased any of the any of the other seasons yet on Blu-ray. Okay, I've got Halt and Catch Fire season one. We have Hannibal season one, two, and three. And I also purchased the complete series box set, which just contains those three um, sets inside. Okay, I've got happy endings. Um, I recently did a video of this. I'm just going to link it up top if you would like to check out the unboxing of it. Um, me and my wife recently rewatched this whole series. It's a great series. I highly recommend you checking it out. Okay, we have the Hatfields and McCoys. Another great series is Heroes. I have Heroes Season 1, 2, 3, and 4. Um, I did watch the um, revival of the show that came out last year or the year before, but I never did purchase that on Blu-ray. I need to check that one out. Okay, I've got Jackson 5, the complete series. This is the animated series. Really good, um, nostalgic type episodes. I have Justice League Season 1 and Season 2. Okay, I've got The Leftovers, the complete first season. Season 2 and Season 3. Legion, the complete first season. Life, the miniseries. Okay, another great show from my childhood is Little House on the Prairie. I've got season one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and the complete ninth and final season. So I remember watching this growing up. We really enjoyed this series. OK, 
Okay, I've got the little rascals. Um, these are um, shorts that were done in 3D. I think it has five episodes on it. So, very good. Really enjoy the little rascals. I have um, Lonesome Dove, the miniseries. We got Looney Tunes, um, the complete volume one on Blu ray. And volume two. Now, that's all that they released on Blu ray. I really wish that they would release all the other um, Looney Tunes shorts on Blu ray. Maybe they will one day. Okay, another great series is Lost. Uh, we watched this complete series back when it um, aired on TV. Really enjoyed it. So we have Lost Season 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. Um, we really look forward to watching this every single week. Um, couldn't wait to see how it ended. Not very happy with the way it ended, but either way it's a good series. Okay, we have Magic City, the complete series. And then here's Madman. This is the final season, part two. Um, I have all the other ones on DVD, so all the other ones were listed in my DVD um, video. Okay, I have The Magicians, season one. I have Agent Carter, season one, on Blu-ray. Very nice. I really enjoyed this series. I hate that it got canceled, but it's got a very nice um, slip cover on it. And then I got the UK release of the Steelbook. I'm really happy to have that. And also I have season two of Agent Carter. So this right here was a great series. It did get canceled. Um, but I'm very happy to have both of these on Blu-ray and definitely with the Steelbooks. So that's Marvel's Agent Carter. And then we have Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. season one. And I have the season one still book from the UK. And then we have Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. season two. And I have season two with the um, still book. So very happy to have both of these. Now after season two, the US quit releasing these on Blu-ray. Um, so the remainder of these I I'm gonna have to get from the UK, but I, do, I did recently receive uh, Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. season three with the still book. So hopefully they'll continue doing these with the still books because I really like them. And then the Netflix show Daredevil. So we have Marvel's Daredevil season one. And I also have the still book edition from the UK for season one. And we have season two still book. Have Marvel's Iron Fist season one still book. And we have Marvel's um, Jessica Jones still book and Marvel's Luke Cage on still book really enjoyed these shows um, I have watched all of these on Netflix um, hopefully we'll get a release of the Defenders with the still book um, but the US I think quit doing these also on blu-ray I know that I've seen Luke Cage at Walmart and I think there was a release of Jessica Jones at one time I'm not sure if it's still available or not I have um, Mr. Robot Season 1, and I have Mr. Robot Season 2, so this is Season 2.0. I don't have any releases after this one yet. I have Narcos Season 1, and Season 2, and I have the miniseries, I guess, of The Night Of. heard a lot of great things about this one. I purchased it, just haven't had a chance to watch it yet. Okay, I've got OJ Made in America, um, the little series that was put out by um, ESPN. Okay, I have Office Season 8 and Season 9. Um, all of my other offices are on DVD. Okay, I've got Once Upon a Time Season 1, 2, 3, 4, five six and the final season seven orange is the new black season one two three and five um, i do not have season four 
Never was able to get a good price on that, so I don't have that one yet. I've got the original Christmas Classics. This is the Anniversary Collector's Edition. This is probably the original one released on Blu-ray. It has a lot of shorts on it that they don't that they haven't released after this package. But I did recently pick up um, this one. This is the newer one. So anyway, I have both of those. I have Outlander Season 1, 2, and 3. Um, the Pacific miniseries. Heard a lot of good things about this. This is a nice 10. Um, I picked that up a couple of years ago when it was on sale. I had the Peanuts Holiday Collection. Penny Dreadful Season 1. And season two. I never did get to see season three. I've seen season one and season two as they aired. Really enjoyed the series. And um, hopefully one of these days I'll be able to check out season three. Um, I've got Planet Earth. Power season one. And season two. Preacher season one um, on the still book. Don't believe that they released season two or three on Blu-ray. But I think it's on DVD. And I have watched all the episodes of Preacher. I really enjoy the series. Okay, another great series. Prison Break. Season 1, 2, 3, 4, and the event series Prison Break. Um, really enjoyed the series and enjoyed the event series. So glad to have that. And I've got... Rescue Me. Um, I recently did a video of an unboxing of this. So I'm going to link it up top if you'd like to check it out. Very great series. I've seen every episode of this. Really enjoyed it. Roots, the miniseries. Really enjoyed this series. I, I was able to watch this when it was out, when it was on TV. Really enjoyed it. I would really like to revisit the original Roots miniseries. I, don't, I do not have that one in my collection. Another miniseries, um, Salem's Lot. And I also have the Salem's Lot still book. Okay, we have Sharknado uh, 1, 2, and 3. Now there was recently a still book release, I believe, or maybe even a box set of all of the um, Sharknado movies. Um, so hopefully I'll be able to get that, but currently I only have these three movies. Silicon Valley Season 1, 2, 3, and 4. Another excellent series is The Sopranos. I've seen every episode of this. Really enjoyed it. Um, I had to buy the box set. So I've got Star Trek, the original series, season one, two, three. I've got the um, Star Trek animated series. And then I've got the um, Star Trek Roddenberry Vault on Blu-ray. Okay, I've got Star Trek Enterprise Season 1, Season 2, and Season 3, and the final Season 4. Star Trek The Next Generation Season 1, 2, 3, and then we have The Best of Both Worlds. Um, this right here was released when Season 3 re was released. Season 4. And then the release of Redemption that came with Season 4's release. Season 5. And Unification that came with Season 5's release. Season 6. And um, Chain of Command that came with the release of Season 6. Season 7, the final season. And also All Good Things that came when Season 7 was released. Okay, we have Star Wars, um, the Clone Wars animated movie. And then we have the series. This right here has Seasons 1 through 5 on it. And then the Lost Missions. Then we have Star Wars Rebels Season 1. And Season 2. 
And then I showed the Stargate collection on DVD. Um, this is a continuation of that with the Blu-ray releases. It's the Stargate, the Ark of Truth, and Continuum. And then Stargate Universe, Seasons um, 1. It has 1.0 and 1.5 for the complete first season, which was actually the complete series. And then Stargate Atlantis. Okay, we have Stephen King's It miniseries. And then I've got the U.S. Steelbook Edition. And I've also got the U.K. Steelbook Edition. Very happy to have both of these. Okay, I've got The Strain. This right here is the complete first season. I don't believe any of the um, later seasons were released on Blu-ray. I think they were released on DVD. But I've got the first season here. And then we have Stranger Things Season 1. And Season 1 with a 4K edition. And Season 2. And Season 2 with a 4K edition. I really like these Target exclusives. Um, this is the only way that you can get the series on Blu-ray or 4K is through Target. And then I've got Supergirl Season 1. And Supergirl Season 2 Steelbook Edition. I really like the way the Steelbook looks. Okay, we have The Terminator, The Sarah Connor Chronicles, Season 1. And Season 2. I really enjoyed this series. Um, I hate that it got canceled, but um, definitely recommend this, recommend this to anybody that really likes the Terminator movies. I've got the 3D classics of The Three Stooges. Um, this is kind of like the, the Little Rascals one I showed earlier. It has four um, little um, shorts of the Three Stooges in 3D. I've got Tin Man. We've got True Detective Season 1. And I've got the Target exclusive Mondo Steelbook of Season 1. And Season 2. The Twilight Zone, the complete series. Very nice box set. Okay, I've got Twin Peaks, the complete series. Really enjoyed Twin Peaks. Um, and then I got the Criterion Collection of Fire Walk With Me that I've included in this. And then the limited event series of Twin Peaks, which I never have got to see this. Um, but I've got the nice box set of that. And then I've got Tut, um, still book from Best Buy. Actually, it's a metal pack from Best Buy. And Veronica Mars. Now, Veronica Mars, I showed all of my DVD releases of that. And so this right here is the um, movie that came afterwards. Okay, I've got The Walking Dead Season 1. And then the complete Walking Dead Season 2 um, with the zombie head. The complete third season still book from Target. And the complete third season, um, The Governor's Zombie Head Tanks. Really like this set. Season 4, still book from Target. And the complete fourth season with The Tree Walker. Looks really nice. Season 5, still book from Target. And the complete fifth season. Season 6, still book from Target. And the complete 6th season. Okay, just the regular release of the 6th season. And then I've got Season 7, still book from Target. And then the regular release. And Season 8, um... Walmart edition with a different variant slipcover and also the complete 8th season still book from Target. I really like the way this one looks. I also purchased all of the lenticular um, slipcovers. I'm going to link a video to that um, that I did several years ago if you'd like to check it out. Um, I have those boxed away and di um, forgot to unbox those for this video. So definitely check that out if you're interested in seeing the lenticular slipcovers.
Okay, I've got Westworld Season 1 still book from Best Buy. And Season 2 still book from Best Buy. And then I've got The Wire, the complete series. And The X Files, this is The X uh, The X Files Fight, The Future, and um, I Want to Believe. I already showed my X File collection out. Unfortunately, I only have those on DVD. I never did get the Blu rays of those yet. So, this is the only um, version that I have on Blu ray. And then, lastly, I have The Year Without a Santa Claus. So that was my complete TV shows on Blu-ray collection. Hopefully you saw something that you liked. Um, maybe you have some of these in your collection. Please leave a comment below. Let me know which of these that you have in your collection, which of these shows that you like to watch, um, which of these that you would recommend me checking out next. Um, I would also like to know if there's any other shows that you are interested in that I do not have in my collection. I would really appreciate it if you leave me a comment and let, and let me know what your recommendations are. But I really do appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. If you like what you saw, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Um, if you do subscribe, I do upload videos um, once or twice a week, sometimes more just depending on what's going on. Um, so remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and on Instagram, so you can check me out there. But I uh, thank you very much for taking your time to watch this video, and we will see you next time. Thank you.